Coach Brewer left the program, obviously, for a job with the Eagles. Um, you've worked with him for so long at Oklahoma State and back here. What was that kind of like, you know, his decision to leave there, the time you spent with him, and, and your thoughts on that story? Well, I mean, you're, you're, uh, it's, it's kind of a bittersweet. I mean, you, you know, you hate to lose a guy, part of your family that's, you know, been with you for 10 years, but uh, at the same time, you're excited for him because it's something that was a goal of his to do, and so you, you're excited for him, and you wish him well, and you, uh, you know, you you move on, and, and he moves on. Do you think was that a tough, tough decision for him to make? Uh, I would think so, you know. I mean, uh, you know, because he loved Carolina and everything about it. He's been here 12 years. I mean, so he's uh, that was a that was a tough thing for him, but it it, uh, it was something that it was too hard for him to pass up at this time in his life. How's Coach Pascal transitioning to the wide receiver role, and what's your history with him and how that kind of came about? Well, I mean, uh, I've been around Luke for a long time. You know, he GA'd under under Coach Brewer at Oklahoma State. Uh, you know, I mean, he's uh, known him for a long time. He's done a he's done a great job. He was here as a GA. You know, uh, so. You know, I, I felt very comfortable moving him into that position because he knows all the terminology, knows all the everything that the receivers have been taught. He knows the offense inside out and backwards. It was just the, it was uh, by far the smoothest transition because he was so accustomed to everything that we do. And then uh, on top of that, giving him the special teams. What do you think?